Hi everybody, it's another video from your favorite crazy entomologist. Looks like I obtained new pets yet again, but this time they aren't butterflies or moths. And it's something more evil than the species I used to study. They are giant water bugs. They have a pretty nasty bite because they're actually ferocious predators that overpower and kill fish, fish and tadpoles and actually frogs. And um, what's interesting, they have an aquatic lifestyle. Here you see one of them in the water. But despite their aquatic lifestyle, they have mastered both air and water, which is impressive. Because they have a pair of wings and are actually excellent uh, and very skilled at flying. This allows them to conquer new terrain, so they can actually fly to new ponds and lakes where if their other uh, their previous habitat isn't suitable. And what they do after catching prey is injecting them with a paralyzing venom, which is why it isn't recommended to handle them. Uh, they have a very painful bite. But I'm not scared. I mean, I've handled many things. If you look at my YouTube channel, you probably know I'm a little deranged. And I have handled the redback spider and I have handled the assassin caterpillar. So these are no problem for me. I mean, yeah, it was sure would suck if I got bitten. But yeah, it's nothing to me. They are very fascinating and I really can't wait to see them hunt and overpower prey. It would be very cool. I hope this one lets go of my hand now. It's starting to get a little bit annoying. And it looks like it has a very tight grip. So it's a problem. I have to shake it off sometime. But I don't want to upset it. So I'm not going to shake it off violently because it might just decide that I'm an, an, a threat. And I don't want to have that beak in my finger. I mean, they, these things, they kill fish. So yeah, it's probably not a very pleasant experience either. Hmm. Well, thanks for watching anime. Um, so if you keep watching my YouTube f videos, I'll make a video and show you uh, a video of these creatures hunting and overpowering prey. Of course, I'm not planning to keep them in this container. This is just very temporary. I'm going to make a nice aquarium for them with plants and prey, maybe a little bit fish uh, guppies or something. And I can even breed them because they're a male and a female, so yeah. Look at this one is, is enjoying my finger now. And it's a little bit concerning how tight his grip is because I can shake it off for the life of me. Hmm. Oh well, fascinating insects anyway. Keep watching my YouTube channel please because I have stuff coming up that's going to be incredible and I know I keep saying it every video maybe because I like my own insects too much but yeah it is pretty incredible so stay tuned